Hello and welcome back. Or oh, welcome, actually, yes, welcome. Now then, this I wanted to be a little bit different. I truly did. It is a new farmer start. I've got time on 0.5. I will show you what I have got, but I want this to be a start from scratch, but yeah, it isn't. It, yeah, it, you start with everything that you've got. So I want to make this a start from scratch because I want this to be a little bit different. I wanted to do, yeah, I'll show you what we own. We own the periphery, which, no, that's not the periphery, Mr. Smith. Yes, we own the periphery, which costs zero. Okay, what is that? We're going to sell everything that we actually own apart from the one thing in fact no let's yeah that is a point let's sell everything and uh, will this allow me to yeah that is right it won't right I'm gonna do what I have done in the past I'm gonna go into a brief time as we are gonna get rid of everything we own everything so that this is a true start from scratch we haven't got the advantage now that was money I added myself that is not yeah that was for a specific reason it was and that class tractor is part of the stuff that you get so yeah I am going to for once tab oh, typical I would tab to the one tractor that's not in the main yard right so we are going to literally get rid of everything I'm going to go into time lapse I'm going to say the words I always say which is I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side Right, yeah, I am gonna I'm gonna get rid of the farm off but this is I find this very time consuming because we're not gonna use this, not at all. Eight and ten and the farmyard are out of bounds. They are. But I will get rid of them. The periphery we will keep and we have three hundred thousand to our name. So I am gonna buy you you saw what I was gonna buy really, yeah. The, the sheep farm. That is what I'm gonna start with. And we have got very little, 142,000 and eight pounds. Now then, will this let us out? Oh no, we own it, so it will. Tem yeah, technically we own it. Right, let's put, no, actually we're not really doing anything properly. So I'm gonna put my speed up a little because I only have just a little old me. Right, we are, oh, ooh, we're gonna go swimming, okay. We're gonna go and find, yeah, we've, well, we're gonna go to our property. That's first and foremost. We are very, very poor. Now, I normally do one placeable, yes. But I'm, I'm trying to shake this up a little bit. I want this to be a little bit different. Ah, I do want interactive zone markers gone. Also, I'm going to just, I want to show you the settings I'm playing on as well. That is half pound kilometers Celsius. We are going to take that off. And we are going to knock that to normal. I want there to be a bit of growth. If I go hard, it's going to be terrible. Seasons, one day seasons. Going to keep the on. It does very little. And fuel usage, we're not. We're going to put a normal. Trailer fuel limit is off because it does weird things to most trailers. I want this lot as if it is on hard. Yeah, on the start from scratch. And maintenance, we're going to do on my tried and tested. And the paint, I'm convinced it doesn't do anything, if I'm honest. Right. Let's save that. So they're my settings. We are on normal economy rather than hard. We have bought this. We have 142,008. We have a partner in H2 Studios who we are going to call in. And they are going to sell us products directly, as I do in almost every single Let's Play this is slightly different to what you will see. I have modified this slightly, hence all of them, but not when I say that. I don't mean I've given myself any f uh, real unfair advantage or... No, I haven't. You will see all I've done. I've, I've, in fact, let's do that. So let's put this down. 
I want to show you that we haven't really committed any... There's no secrets that I've uh, put in or anything. Ah, okay. That is interesting. Shop areas? Was, ah. Have I... Yes, I may have done. Okay, let's try that again. Do you know? Always, always... I don't understand why that's doing that, though. I don't understand why... Now, there were trees there, perhaps. Or is it too close to the wall? I don't really want that. Yeah, that is true. I think the best possible place for this that's not going to get in the way. Now, I'm... Yeah, this is going to be the start, I would say, there. I've got to pass that. Spashing. Right, okay. We're going to need water. I would say so. I would say that, uh, yeah, this, this is going to need water. So, is that... I think that is the water, if I remember rightly. We are using the Omatana one. Let's zoom in a little. Because I really do like this. It's fantastic. Now, if I was a real farmer, I would stick a proper ball cock in, as as I have seen frequently in Britain. So, yeah, that isn't really going far enough. So, we've got our water. We have a thing to buy. And we are going to... Yeah, that is a point. This is all that we own. And no placeables. Yeah, that is part of this. I'm trying to make this a real challenge. I am. So, is that going to... Let's just do a bit of yeah, landscaping. Yeah, this is tough. It really is. Right, let's do a bit of smoothing. Softening, sorry. I've got to get used to saying softening, not smoothing. That's so, FS19. Right, yeah, I did... I caught up. There's a tree down here, but really? That doesn't gain me anything. <laughs> Let's <laughs> wish to fall off a cliff. So yeah, I did have plans. I was I was toying with a few ideas, you could say, but that one I thought nah. So I put this little road in, and I got rid of the little trees. I also yeah, because I did that, you weren't supposed to do that. This was actually yeah, you could see underneath the building. So I've done that. Yeah, absolutely have, because I'm planning on feeding our uh, our cows, our sheep. I don't very often do sheep, but I thought you know I'd like to go different. I always do. Yes, there's still going to be grass. Yeah, I am going to cut the grass field, and I'm going to feed the. Uh, the sheep so we're gonna have to avoid these obstacles which yeah so there might be quite a lot of manual cutting we're also gonna be we are very very skint so I would turn the time up this is our yeah we're actually making this into our house we are if it lets us that is of course so farmhouses yeah we are going for the ultimate in super duper Let's twizzle it around. Letters. Ooh. Hmm. Now that that <laughs> that that was unforeseen. I don't know what that's about, but I get the sleep trick still works. Uh, right. Yeah. That that was definitely unforeseen. That's a, a map glitch. It is very very brand new. Why have I chosen to come on Thornton? Well. This is the Let's Play that got away. I, well, actually, it's not. It didn't get away. I did it, and it was one of my favourite maps. If I'm honest, it really was one of the favourite British maps I ever did. But it never had any viewers. Because I did it on my second YouTube account that has absolutely no viewers. And to this day, I don't think anyone's watched it. And it was one of my favourites. So I thought, do you know something? But I don't want to do the same. I shall show you what I did do. I went... My field was 14 down the bottom, and I then bought 29 and 12 and 13, and I did grass, and we bought 15, and we bought 16, and then when we'd done that for a while, I was on hard economy, we bought this, and we went into the normal farmyard. But you know, I don't really want to do that, I don't. I want to, I want to create a let's play that's completely different from what everybody else will do. I want to go start from scratch. We bought our property, we now need to buy, yeah, we are going to need vehicles. We are. And if we're going to need to cut grass, we're going to need a mower. Now then, let's have a look what is on sales. Okay. That telehander, as much as it is fantastic, 
and so is the single cab but again it's not enough of a thing to actually tempt me now that is very useful truthfully it really is I would love to buy that but it would seriously it would seriously cripple us it really would so I'm really yeah unsure and that again would cripple us so it's out of our price range I am going to allow lease in because we are very very poor truthfully are um, yes I'm not sure how to do things but I do know this we need to buy some sheep yeah and we're gonna we're gonna build this up because that is a point out how am I gonna do this that is true yes plans okay right, let's see if we could do what I'm thinking about doing right productions and this is probably the only one we could afford that will do what we want it to do it is by the Lord I'm not going my BGA route because that no, have I passed it do you know what? I always always sneak past this somehow ah there we go Sure. Now, uh, yes. Okay. Ah, it doesn't like this because it's classed as a special field. Aha. Yes, it does. The entire field is classed as something special. Ooh, ah, okay. Not the entire field, just the bottom half. Let's look for the flattest possible area. Ah, it's only certain bits at the very top. Do we need access at the top? It does do the pallets at the other side. That much I do know. Right. smoothing let's go down yeah that's seriously we do need some animals you know we do this is true all my life smoothing Now then, this is seriously leaving me with very little. Right, okay. Well, we definitely need animals. Can we... How? I was going to say, what vehicle am I going to leave myself? How can I manage to do this? That is what I want to know myself. If you know placeables, I'm going to... Do I allow myself one placeable? It's reasonable. No, this is the challenge, it really is. Yeah, it is. I mean, this is going to be an absolute backbreaker because I don't know how many animals we can even afford. Right, so sheep produce wool. That's, all, that's the idea. Now, are we going to do eight months? Do we go for cheap? Because I'm not sure we can actually. Yeah. I don't know that we. What? What's the difference? don't think there is, is there? We're going to go for Black Welsh Mountain. She produce wool. Is there a difference? That's all I'm going to say. I think we're going to have to. We're going to go cheap because we can't really afford many more than that, if I'm honest. And what are we going to afford at that 10,000? Yeah, we've got to go quite a few. Total. Let's do the 12. 54. 55. Yeah. No, 54. I agree. Bye. Absolutely yes. Right. Shut the gate. We now need to. Yeah. We, we'll have to put the gate in here. You'll have to bear with me on this. These are very well trained sheep. They are. Yeah, we, we will put something in there. That is obviously why the trees were there originally and silly of me has moved them without thinking about the consequences of said thing now we need to buy yeah we are going to cut the grass to give them that is a point actually 
Is there anywhere to store said grass, though? Oh dear, that is... We're going to have to do something about that, and that's got to be done free of charge, because that is ridiculous. Now then, a small silo? Small storage? I think I can only afford something like one of the Omatanas, if I'm honest. I can't think that I can... I'm going to need some means of storing, and it's got to be multi-fruit, I think. Or do I? Can I just store it in a... Right, okay, let's scoot over to the shop. First things first. Right, production. I'm just trying to stay out of my menus as much as possible. I'm trying to make it as realistic as possible. We're down to 100,000. This is like New Farmer all over again. We're not... Yeah, we're going to stick it up to one time once we've done all of this. Yeah, beginning. Bits. Right, okay. It's a point. I where is the shop? Yeah, I've I've been to the eight, the nineteen, but is it in here? Okay. Is it in front of? I may need to switch zone markers on because yeah, it used to be in the middle somewhere here. If I remember rightly. Right, okay, I give in, because it just makes you look silly. It really does. Right, that's repair. And the shop is right there. I can't put a mark on the floor. Right. Now then, vehicles. Can I go for something like the little bear? Or do we go for the retriever? I'd say the retriever's probably heavier. Hmm, standard three points. Speed 65 kph, it's about 40 miles an hour ish. That's faster. It only has a trailer hitch. I think we'll go for the Kubota. I've not had one yet, so why not? Shall we go standard to begin with and then add it if we need it? No, that is very reasonable for a three-point. Obviously, we're not trying to yeah, move mountains with this. Or are we going to go for... Yeah, that is a point. Are we going to go for a tractor? That's, yeah, that's, this is true. This is... I like to do things naturally. I could have done all of this where I am literally yeah, chatting and all the rest of it, and I've gone through this already, but I like it to be natural. I do. I'm wondering, should I go for my tried and tested the little Zeta? This has saved my bacon many times. Do we go for one of the Antonio Carrera pack? 19 horsepower. Hmm. Yeah, they're getting expensive now. What's that? That's a point. I've never had one of those. What does that mean? Blade attach. Uh, it's got a front grid. What does that mean? It means that. 74 horsepower, 130 is 1,500 more with just an attacher. Speed is terrible, but it's only for around the yard. It will know it. Will, I think, do you know, I reckon that would drive everybody crazy. I really do. Yeah, I can't. As would the Fiat. It's thinking Zeta. Oh, there is, of course, yes. Well, if for English maps, I would say you'd have to go for that. The Russell Bash, 12 kph, that's even slower. 43, 50, 49, 116, 30. It's not got a front three-point link, but then it is as a little Zeta. We c it has got a, it has got a three-point at the back, and it has got that little one at the front. So I'm thinking we start with 59 horsepower and we upgrade it. I do. I 
I, I think I don't think I can beat it for at the minute. I am very skint, really skint. I don't think I can. You know, it does get through fuel a lot. Yeah, I can't afford anything at the minute. Yeah, I think that's a good point. It does actually cost you. Let's just go in. We'll have it as is then. Really, we'll fifty nine horsepower. We can, yeah, we are going to buy it. We do need it. It is slow, but not absolutely awfully slow. Right, so we've got that. We're going to need a trailer. We are, and it's got to be cheap. This is not yeah what I would normally go for. Everything we've got to do has got to be done to a budget. I mean, literally. So it's not going to be massive. Now, I know what I think I'm going to go for, because this is mainly for grass. It is does everything though but it's 4-4 four, four. it is dearer and what I was thinking about would be my tried and tested now, I'm te if, if I'd got more money I would go IT runner I really would because it is so reasonable and versatile for someone like myself but not even that can I afford at the minute yeah I'm thinking about going for my tried and tested when we get there, I've got way too many. The two PTS solid axle, which does limit how much it has. You can't go for the the ten thousand tons. Now we've got trailer fill limit of. Otherwise, this would only allow three and a half, four and a half tons, as it says on there. So this has got a capacity of ten tons and anything ten tons, but is, in my opinion, one of the most cheap trailers that you can have. So we are indeed going to buy that. So we have a trailer. Now then, we are going to need a means of water, of doing water. And again, this has got to be done on the cheap. Now there is actually, this is true. Yeah, this, I I don't know what pack this came with, but this I noticed the other day. Not that it is, it is a knockoff of the Aquatrans. Yes, I have got to admit this. It is, but it is the liquid tank, the Lizard 15,300 and is very versatile, can do all of that I think we've got to say absolutely yes and we'll keep it green because we can't afford absolutely cannot right so that is do we need a chainsaw? No we don't and we need to cut grass and we need to pick grass up yes we do this is true so what can we do to pick grass up. Gonna go, oh, yes, we, there is the very cheap. I think to begin with, there is only one mower that strikes me as, and you, if you've seen any of my Let's Plays, and know what I'm, yeah, the cheap, terribly cheap mower. And I mean, they don't get any cheaper than this. It is super duper. The RDMR is, and it is quite big. I've got to be honest now. Horsepower is 100. Right. That's out then. 50, 60 for a 3. These are very reasonable. 70. Now I'm 65. I reckon we could probably get away with that. And I hate sliding most, but hey ho, you cannot. Yeah, it's green logo, swath plate. Swath plate. Oh. Tank and weight set balls. What does that mean? I don't understand what that means at all, but we are going to buy this. I've never tried this, but yes, we're going to buy that. Now then, how do we... Right, windrowers. Now that, now that, again, this is... Yeah, on my Lapacho, we had to go very, very cheap, and there is a super-duper windrower. I mean, really, yeah, and it is from the uh, Soviet Union, or the, the, uh, the Eastern Bloc, and it is this. It's 1,300. It isn't. It's not massive. It's 35 horsepower, so we can actually do this. And, right, so we now need to either bale or loose. Now, we, I might lease this in the hope that at some point... Now, that is amazing. that We've still got 72,000. We have a tractor... <laughs> <laughs> my tried and tested tractor. Don't laugh at that. That little Zeta is a mighty beast. It is fantastic. That 
three PTS is amazing. That is super duper. That is super duper two. We might just about get away with it, and we've got that as well. So all we've got to do is worry about is getting the grass. Now then, I'm still thinking silo, if I'm honest. Right, I am going to cut back to the farm. I'm not going to show you me dragging them all over there. That would be rather boring. So I shall see you when we have this lot back over the farm. And then we shall also discuss whether we are going to stick the grass or no. No, yeah, I am. But we do need to store it, really. I know, I know realistically it doesn't go off. Anyway, yeah, we should have this debate over there. I'm going to see you shortly. Hello and welcome back. Right, we have... Yeah, I've... I, I, what I did was I did a... I reloaded it. Everything went wrong. It did and I thought, you know, I don't really like the idea of that. So I put the sleep mat down the bottom. This is still where we live, but yeah, it's a bit more believable than a mound of earth that sits on the thing. I've got everything back to pretty much where it was that the water i think i've bought everything that i had before i thought i will probably add for realism's sake a gate here but i won't charge myself we'll just class it as yeah realism's sake yeah and the same as that there's a little bit might yeah don't know what i'll do to make that bit or whether we stick something over here or yeah can't say we've got really good sheep to do that. Oh, the minute I've locked it off with equipment, cough, cough. <laughs> right, so we've got everything. We've got the um, we've got young sheep, so they're not going to be producing wool or yeah, have it, having babies or anything like that. But we have got low costs. I'm hoping this is not going to. Yeah, we've got no means of doing this now. We can do contracts. I'm not saying we're not going to do contracts, but. I have got to be honest, I do really want to be concentrating on our farm so that the days and the months f go sort of, yeah. So we've got a means of cutting grass and we're going to feed them with our own grass. But how do I pick the grass up at present? We can put a full loader on there. Is that the most? I'm, I'm seriously tempted to go um, forage wagon. Just go for the really, really little one. But to lease, to do a full cut, and to lease the little one. If I remember rightly, though, the yeah, there aren't any super duper D. Oh, hang on, what's that one? How much? Do, oh dear, that is very small. I think I'd sooner go for pay a little bit dearer. And go for more. Mind you, it's horsepower, isn't it? Let's have a look at the base one. 60 horsepower, we could just manage that. And it's got 16. That's 95. So we could only manage the little one, to be honest. So we that's all we could lease. But I do think we should do that. I do. Do we buy? The trouble is, it devalues quite quickly. The trouble is, we've got this tractor for a while. We have no way of storing. Unless we do buy one of the cheap Omentana storages. We could, I suppose. Now, that is a point. There's something strange about... Yeah, obviously we saw that with the production. Silos. Let's have a look at the small Omentana ones. It doesn't need to be super duper either. It can be, in fact, it doesn't need to be the Omentana ones. It's just that they take bales at a later time. Yeah, they're rather little granaries. That one has got a limit of 100,000 litres. But is that really going to be a problem to us? Mind you, I'd sooner go with 200,000. Yeah, this, it's got, you've got this overlaps with another object because of what this is classified as. So it's not, it only lets you put things up this top end, which is rather limiting, to say the least. Could stick it up there, does it? No, it really is. It's just got to be at this top end. Now, I do know that, shall we? Shall we commit? Yes, we shall. And we shall do some landscaping, and we shall soften that, and let's go. Remember, this is destroying our field, our grass that we're going to be cutting. It is, but... So 200,000 storage limit, reasonable, yeah, a reconditioned granary from uh, Europe. 
So we have a means of storage. We shut the gates. We shall. Yeah, the one thing, uh, one leniency I will allow myself is we will stick some sort of um, proper thing we shall do off camera here. Yeah, I didn't think of that. That was the one thing I didn't think about was the fact that the field is not an enclosed space and the sheep would escape. The sheep would escape. So, right. Yeah, I do think we're going to lease probably. Or do we buy? It would seriously skin us. We do need to get. Mind you, we're not buying grass. We can store grass and grab the grass out and feed them with it. The water's free. We have a. Uh, so let's first of all let's water the sheep. That's all I'm going to say. We, yeah, I did everything exactly the same. We have the same amount of. I did actually tell this to fill earlier. Now this has got a bit of a sinkhole here, so some of this is not going to be the easiest to actually mow. We may have to do something about that because, yeah, this little zeta's not going to cope with, yeah, it's slightly, yeah, it'll get stuck. I've had a little bit of that on my greenlands where we have two of these as our mowers. Yeah, I am in first first person perspective. I am stuck in this and I've done it by choice for realism's sake. Now, where do we... Yeah, that is a point. Where do we actually... Well, I suppose if we wander around, we should find the point at which this wants to... Well, it's selected. Yes, we have. There's only so many places it can be. It says so confidently. Well, it is true. There's only so many places this can be. I have tried this on other places. Please don't tell me that this isn't going to work. Got to start filling. Oh, problems, problems. I know it's only just been released, but seriously, why is it when I choose a map that I get right? Okay, let's first of all let's stick zone markers on just to make sure. No, that's not what we're after. No, it's not. Let's switch zone markers on. Okay, well it should be right there. Might be sensitive, it could be one of those. It's just up and go all the way around and it never, never appeared at any moment but Let's try something in case it doesn't like the Omatana filling thing right next to it. Let's sell that and just make sure it's not that. No, it's not. Do we have to open this? Has it got a... No, there's nothing on there for us to do anything, so I've, I've had this before, what am I on about? Right, okay, actually let's go forwards a little bit, thinking about it, yeah it could be still... Right, this this is a game mechanics issue, so I am going to what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the store to deliver because this is not really happening, this is just us testing now. Right, let us lease and we will give ourselves the money straight away. I'm just testing. I always go back to the base game stuff because the Joss skin yeah, if there's anything that's gonna work, so four hundred and eighty four and twelve, four hundred and eighty four, four hundred and ninety six 496 leasing given back straight away. Yeah, I always find, right, the other thing is, let's stick the, we know it wasn't that, it wasn't the Omatana, it is, yeah, it is like the day after release. I always have to do this silliness of going from map straight away. Let's do it this end. That way at least it's not 
conflicting with the right let's do it like that as well. Right, smashing. Okay, right, let's grab that. Sheep's quite happy, sitting on the floor. Happy than I am. Everything's going wrong straight away. Yeah. But I was determined. I was looking up at this at the same time as Attingham and I thought I really want to do this no matter what I do. It is true. Right. Okay, let's grab some water and see if it is. It doesn't like that. It hasn't been. Yeah, we haven't had this before. The base game one seems to work best with everything, so. Let's just try that. And there's nothing wrong with this trailer either. That that one is perfectly okay. I just love it when things go wrong. Oh dear. Hang on a minute. I'm just trying to think. Am I getting this? Is that? Because it says start filling. Right. Let's let's get rid of the overtime. I've just seen. Have I got the wrong end of the stick? This is possible, this is me. So you again. No, it was it was picking up that. That is showing us that we need to put water in just there. Yeah, that's that's definitely not us. If the Aquatrans doesn't do it, nothing will. That is honestly true. Let's just have a bit of a wonder that we all know that uh, let's not run the sheep over. Let's it's not always a precise place. Yeah, let's just have a bit of a drive around and see if it, it flickers at any point. Could be in the wrong place. To own the land or it wouldn't allow us to put sheep here. Ah, there you go. It's got to be on the dot, right? Okay then. Interesting. Right. So then, let's stick that. <laughs> See, we all know the, the sort of things that go on with this. Yes. Joskin back. We shall see. And uh, we probably have filled it now. Right, let's send that back now. We know that works. Return. Absolutely. Because we know it works. Absolutely does. Now let's now see. Is there. Let's have a look in the, the animal section. Water. Ah, we can put more in. Smashing. Let's have a go then. So it needs at the back of our thing right on the dot. It really does. Do you know, I was hoping to be cutting grass at all sorts. Right, let's, let's, now we know the secret. Need to be right on the... with the back of the knockoff aqua traps. The lizard. Yeah, let's let's not yeah. Let's go back a little.
That looks pretty much in the same place to me. It seems to like the Aquatrans. Yeah. If I just go through the hatch, we have. You know, we have started filling, but we don't have any release. that precise it really is exactly on the water oh my life right okay well I think we've got to drop this here and leave it precisely I'm sure this will be fixed I'm sure it won't be this precise at some point right let's switch into active so Mark because you've got to laugh or you really would cry Right, smashing. Let's drop that. At least we can fill it and leave it there all in one go. That is amazing. Right, so we've watered them. Now we need to, yeah, we do need to grab some grass. We don't need to cut the entire field, but we shall cut some grass. I'm going to time lapse this because this has been rather, it has been rather, yes, now that is a point. Yeah going to crack on with store delivery still as well. We are we will lease the forage wagon, I think, to begin with. That's the point. If we're going to do this, though, we want to cut quite a bit of grass. Yeah, this is true. No point in half measures. Right, yes, we are going to go into... This is going to take a while, because this is yeah, a bit of a beast. Right, I am going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side. Now we need to go the wrong way round, don't we? Yes.
I'm gonna yeah call this first session here not that I'm gonna end it but yeah I'm li literally gonna have a look at what's Baylor's little Baylor's and all all the little implements that I can possibly do this so I can do it justice there's quite a lot of grass there that took an absolute age it truly did really enjoyed it though yeah I, I do love this the challenge yeah we've missed a bit of grass here I realize that but you know it, it is what it is yeah some of the bits of the fields were awful there is that bit, like I said a sinkhole I, I think what we're going to do is we're going to call the bulldozers, bulldozers in and get this replanted at some point wink wink <laughs> Yeah, but for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the session. I'm going to have a good look at Baylor's and to see what my options are. Because there are a couple of cheap ones. But, yeah, let me just show you what I was thinking. I think, really, it's forage wagons. But they are, yeah, truthfully, they are expensive, as we all know. But there are a couple of very cheap Baylor's. But the capacity is too high. Yeah, these ones are... Oh, Oh, they're not. They're 45 horsepower. But they're the same price as the... Yeah, and then we've got our bale loaders. If you do it loose, it's 30 grand the same. It is, but it's... Yeah, that is true. It is, really, when you consider it. If you were going to consider buying that, I think we probably will lease that. I'm going to have a look at my options, I truly am, but I think, if I'm honest, that's what we're going to end up doing. We should put grab all of that and stick it in our storage bin that's why I've gone for a small silo yeah and I've got this on to do wall to clothes but it's on it's on store rather than sell so I'd like to I'd like to do this properly because we are yeah there's no there's nothing no safety nets there's no thing that's going to give me X amount of money each day or anything like that it's it is always versus the oh wow that is quite bad yeah there is quite a lot of smoothing I think to do if I'm honest to make this yeah we're going to remodel it let's just put it that way yeah it's, it is truthful would you do that though in real life or would you just get a bigger yeah that is a it is a point actually yeah warts and all I'm going to do warts and all I might do that one that really is a sinkhole. I do think any farm would improve the field that he's got, but there are some of these where the lay of the land is just a little bit, that, you know, I think we're going to have to put up with. But, yeah, that sinkhole, that we will. Yeah, I, I do think that's reasonable, that uh, any farm is going to try to improve his far field going forwards. Right, what we're going to do quickly is let's just move it out of the way. Yeah, 65,946. I'm going to write that down. So whatever this costs is just this I would have done at the beginning of the let's play had I thought obviously I did remodel we all know that I said that so it's not like and I did have all of that money to do this so I would have done this here had I have yeah, wow Zeta's got ever such a I mean I, I, I'm getting bad at this the um, first person perspective but I've got to be honest the Zeta it's hard the seeds in really because it's such a small tractor it's ever so hard the three point link is so far forward I suppose because it's a small tractor truthfully right so we're going to place a bit of a gate if it allows us yeah because and I think we'll do it back we should it forward at the front this may the land is a little bit funny so this is was yeah we're going to get this back doesn't really matter does it truthfully um, gate double gate really if I'm honest that's gates there weird gates and these gates no it's fence right now they're gates yeah but they're small gates are they bigger? They would actually... Uh, terrain too steep. We may need... Right. Okay, so that looks like we've got to soften the grounds. Uh, might need to level to make this work. And if we go from the middle... Right, OK, 
Okay, let's try that. Remember, we are paying ourselves back this as well, and we're going to put the grass back. All yeah, because this is this should have been done at the beginning, but yeah, silly of me as always. Didn't decoration. Ah, these are all gates. Ooh, now that's. That's quite large. Now we need the fence that goes with it. Right, so then if we take 62948, I prefer to do it this way, minus 62948, and then add 65946. Smashing, so we're right where we should be. Did say we'd do that actually. Why did I do that so soon, Wally? Right, let's. Um, we might have to shut the gates. It might not let me do this. I might need to do this again. Gordon Bennett, you know, seriously. I suppose it's not it's not the end of the world, it really isn't. Ah, that's let me do that. Right, let's put some plants down. Nine four six ah that's, that's I'm not right with that. That's th two or three hundred. We can uh, live with that. There's a little tiny bit of wrongness then. Just with that there, where the gate goes. Let's see what it's like when you've got grass there. Can you see it terribly? Ah, no, it sort of does hide it. Now we know it, obviously. Yeah. Right, I can live with that. That's more, more realistic. It can't get any better, really. But yeah, it is what it is. Smashing. That's, that's believable. I want realism. Right. There we go, so I'm going to have a good look now and see what options we've got, if there's anything any smaller for I don't think there is, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure whether we do buy that or whether we lease it, And because obviously you're only cutting the grass two or three times. I am seriously considering, that's a point, let's just reset that, I can't remember if I did. I am going to buy a fertiliser spreader. I am. I know it seems a bit. Uh, we haven't. Yeah, that's true. Probably have to lease. Mind you, this is classed as a proper field. That is a point, actually. Is it? Have a look on it. Does it tell you field information? It does. Soil, grass, fallow. Yes, yeah, so it is a proper field. Right. Okay. In that case, we will definitely get a. The super duper cheap one well, again this is the ones these are the things that you learn when you're doing on a start from scratch truthfully now are we going to go for the ultra cheap one or are we going to go for the new one that i like that's 27 meters spread oh the kubota ones you know they're much more expensive than what i was going to go for i was going to I mean, the ac2 is good but this the fs62 is super duper it's not got a massive capacity but it does both and it's got a 28 meter spread then there's my old faithful the 18 meter for three four fifty bolts it can store a bit bigger but this you can put a trailer on it as well so do you know something i'm gonna go for the big e uh, we're gonna leave the colors as is for once we are and three and a half grand yep We'll not be able to do any spraying, we won't, or anything fancy, but that's, we've now got that. 
trying to wonder. Normally, I am trying to move away from gas pumps. Uh, that's a point. Where is the nearest? Where is the where the actual f where we feel? I don't think there is one, is there? I think... Ah, the, the proper ones, the large petrol tank. That's what I'm trying to move to myself, is to petrol tanks, but this time I can't really afford it, if I'm honest. So I'm going to go for a pay-as-you-go one, where we pay someone to stick us a, a put... I mean, it is, it, it's there. It's not. I'm not cheating or anything. It is, it is what it is. But I'm trying to move away from these, but I really... This is so close to the bone. I can afford... Can you actually... partially fill these because it's not much dearer I suppose Let's see, can we stick this over here I would like to would let me do that it wouldn't let me do the other don't want it too close to the yeah I think actually I prefer it there oh that did something with the landscaping that did something strange Ooh really did. Wow. Okay. Now let's go and see. Can we, do we have to put 10 tons in? Oh, it's still not right. Do we have to put the full amount in? That's animal dialogue. It's here. Oh, you can put more. I didn't realise you could do that. 100 litres. Let's do 1,000. I didn't realise you could do that, so there you go, that's not too bad, because it's it's about the same price for the proper ones anyway, the, the proper tanks, so, ooh, has that done something to the wall? No, that's that's okay, that's not too bad. Right, so we've sorted the problem out, because this has got a very small tank and we'll run out of fuel very, very quickly, as I know from experience. So we're down to 58 grand. First session over, I'm going to grab the grass next session, but it has been a long one, it really has. I'm going to time lapse, I have time lapse the, uh, as well, no, I will do in editing, but yeah, that's, that is, otherwise it would drive you crazy. And I do realise, although I'm trying to do sheep, it's typical, I've done a grass start again, but <laughs> I've got no option. And it's not a grass start in the, tr yeah, I've not done my BGA start, this is completely different from what I would normally do. So sheep is what we're going into. We've got that to go into. I didn't show you, did I? Because uh, I set that up again after it went wrong. We've got clothes. I did say, yeah. No, clothes, storing, and obviously fabric wool. So we're going to need to drag, do the wool, take the wool up there. So, yeah, we're going to need a means of loading at some point. Maybe a front loader or... I might get an auto loader. I, I might allow. I did say that a long time ago. I don't, I don't like auto loads, but the pallet wise, or do we just go pallets and a front loader and stuff like that? Oh, wow, that is really bad. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm honest. I shall give it some thought. So I am going to say I really do hope you stick with me on this journey. It is a departure from the norm, and it is. This is no holes barred. It's sink or swim. We have got no safety in it. No way of earning money that I would normally do because I want this to represent us versus the environment. We have got... The, we can do contracts, but I am trying not to, if I'm honest. Let's do... Yeah, it's a little tiny bit that... Oh. Let's see if we can do softening it. It's a little tiny. That's it. I think, I think that's... Yeah, that's not too bad. You say you could see under it, it was a bit annoying. So, this is, yeah, let's have a look. Remind myself what was on Super Duper. Yeah, that's amazing, but yeah, we're down to 58 grand. We can get a front loader on this. It's This is a, that's what I love about this. It is a jack of all trades. You can put the band around, see. We would need to get a small weight, but there's a self made weight. There's a lot of, well, there's drums and all sorts that we can. Yeah, we can do if push comes to shove. So this could be our jack of all trades until we earn some money to actually turn this around. But I, that's why I've done it on, give myself a fighting chance, it is on normal economy. Because I thought if I do this on hard and I put all of these 
caveats that I can't do this and I can't do that. I thought, well, you, you are going to make it absolutely tough. So, yeah, we are. Right, anyway, yes, I am going to say thank you very much for watching and goodbye for now. <laughs>